Good morning, my friends. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Where is Brittany? I'm Brittany, and I'm coming to you from inside of my Mini Cooper this morning. <laughs> so today I'm actually prepping for a trip, and I'm going to take you guys along for the ride. I actually have a few things I need to get accomplished, but first things first, I need to go to the grocery store and pick up some food. So let's go. Hi everyone, I'm Brittany, this is my little fur baby Jada, and the star of this trio is Domino, my 1998 self-converted four-window short bus. I've had Dom since summer 2019, and so far I've put over 11,000 miles on my tiny little home going on solo adventures. Make sure you hit the subscribe button so you always know where is Brittany. It is so cold <laughs> right now. I've let the car heat up for a bit, but that ain't do nothing. It's a whole 23 degrees. <sighs> so yeah, let's go to the grocery store. Yeah, so I don't know how I spent $100. And I don't even have that much stuff, but mm, yay. Here's my little bit of groceries. Literally. That's it. A hundred dollars. <sighs> they got me. Okie dokie. So I have the groceries and now I'm about to head home and like turn on my fridge and Dom, put the groceries away. And Domino is a complete mess <laughs> like I'm not even joking like she's a hot mess so you'll see all right my friends I'm back at Dom if you didn't believe me she is a hot mess watch okie dokie timber oh yeah let's zoom out a bit okay so Dom is still a mess from when I was working on my propane heater. So, this is what she looks like now. And it's my job to get her back together. So, I'm going to go ahead and turn on my fridge first, put my groceries in, and then turn on some music, and then straighten all of this up. Okay, my friends, I hope you can see me and hear me okay. Um, I'm about to open up the bus doors, turn on this freaking propane heater because it's like so cold in here, and then see how fast I can clean this mess up. <laughs> Currently, it's like 23 degrees, so <laughs> that's not gonna take much. Oi. Let's move this up. Okay, so the propane heater's on, <laughs> and my fingers are so frozen. Oh, okay. All right, I'm about to cool down a bit or warm up a bit because this is just too much. <laughs> I am like cold. I'm a flight risk I don't think they're ready for the shit Take a flight to Cali for the bit They don't ever wanna see me win That's a lot of conversation See me going up, I'm off the grid Wanna make a couple murders for my kids Always walking to the money, never slip Only telling all the truth, I never fit All the same, all the same, all the same Spend some money, do some shit for the fame 
go sky in the rain Hit the brakes I don't ever wanna see the face I'm from Canada and not the States Say I'm working way too hard, I need a break Bitch, I'm like a boat, I'm like, I need to slow down That's just what they say, shit I'm on a road now, Santa's making lists, bitch These what they want to but they don't ever say shit Back to the basics, you gotta keep your pace I'm risk And I bought these, which are magnetic car mounts. And basically, this is what it is. It's a two-pack. Um, I'm going to have one actually somewhere back in this area for the kitchen. And then I'm going to mount one up front. Um, I was looking on YouTube analytics. And it actually shows that you guys um, like it when you see my views for when I'm driving. So I bought those to help with that. Um, you guys hopefully get better views and then the second one I'm gonna actually start doing some cooking tutorials well not necessarily cooking tutorials because I don't really use recipes I just kind of cook to taste I add the ingredients and then I just add you know stuff you know extra stuff cook to taste so I can't really like <laughs> do like a full you know like tutorial or like a real cookbook or something like that because I'm not one of those people but I'm going to have one of these up in this area, probably mounted on top of the ceiling so you can get a better view of, you know, my cooking setup. So, yeah, I have those. groceries all right so let's take a look at what i'm about to put in my fridge these are basically my groceries for the next i think about four or five days i do have some additional stuff i'm going to bring in for my kitchen at the house like eggs and stuff but uh yeah that's pretty much it <clears throat> okie dokie so here's my meat doing some lobster cakes some bacon. I'm gonna make some um, turkey tacos. Y'all, these was 50 cent. Little baby patty pies. <laughs> um, got some soups, soups, hummus. Found this. I'm so excited. And normally, I don't. Not normally. Like I just don't keep liquor in Dom. I don't drink in Dom. None of that. But Andrew is going to meet me up in like two days, two, yeah, two days. So he's going to come up. So I got some liquor and, uh, or wine or whatever. Um, and so I'll have that while he's here. But yeah, I don't keep wine or liquor or anything in Dom just for my peace of mind. Like, <laughs> cause I feel like, <laughs> you know, when you drink, it's not easy to just, you know, turn it off just in case like you get tipsy and stuff. And if, you know, things go wrong, I need to be able to just, you know, put them keys in the ignition and just drive off in Dom. So I don't normally keep, you know, liquor or wine in here, but because my husband's going to come and, you know, chill out, I decided to get, you know, two little things of wine. Okie dokie, my friends, I'm about to get ready to move Dom. So in order to move her, I have to make sure everything is like closed up. I have to take the reflectix off and all that stuff. So I'll just show you that process as well. So I lock up the cabinets with these strings. Oh, you can't see me. So basically this is how I secure my cabinets. I already did this one and have this additional piece of string and I just loop it through and just tie it around the edge in a knot and it stays in place ta-da ta-da all right so I'm gonna put you guys back this will work for now sorry about that I'm just kind of like a black blob <laughs> I'm like uh 
characters that's waiting to be unlocked in a video game. So maybe when I put up the visors, you'll be able to see me. Oh, it just fixed itself. <laughs> So I have these up and it's time to take all of these down. And I basically <laughs> and I basically just store these underneath the bed while I'm driving. They stink. So although I've had Dom for over a year now, I always use my backup camera like, it's just like an extra set of eyes. So I'm gonna turn that on as well. And now Dom is actually ready to hit the road. Well, friends, this is it for today, but come back and join me next week as I continue this adventure with Jada. Miss Thing experiences van life for the first time and is introduced to her leash. I must say, traveling with the puppy wasn't a walk in the park, but that's the story for another time. See you next week, friends. Bye.